stand clear of the closing doors, please. some inflatable dinosaurs? Inflatable brontosauruses. Brontosauri? Brontosauruses? Um, to be specific. So Rebecca is currently about to blow it up. So stay tuned. It's happening. Oh, it is. I can see it getting plump. Oh my god, it's leg. Oh my god. It's really quality. <laughs> da, 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 da. Oh my god. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> so cute.
A little something, a little something to show. Who is this for? Can you say something to all your fans? Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> applied my night cream and I'm ready for bed. Tonight was so freaking fun. I had a blast. I love karaoke. I love it so much and I love my co-workers so so much. I love my job and I just feel very blessed right now. Um, it's very late. It's like 1-ish, 1 1.30 and I'm doing everything I can to like make sure i don't feel like shit tomorrow because i had like a couple drinks and like a little shot and um and it's a late night so i know like i'm gonna feel a little bit like trash tomorrow but like not that bad i'll walk you through my routine so i'm use i use this olay total effect seven in one anti-aging moisturizer <laughs> i mixed some of young living's frankincense essential oil in the lotion and spread it all over my face and like on concentrated on spots that I have. The next thing that I'm doing is drinking a lot of water. I have almost like, I have more than half already done rock and roll and I've made myself some tea and I um, dropped a few drops of the Thieves essential oil because it's supposed to keep your immune system strong and it's supposed to make sure you don't get sick and I'm worried about getting sick because it's the holiday season. I oftentimes get sick right around Christmas. Being sick is the worst. Knock on wood. I don't want to get sick. Anyway, that'll help with the immune system. Also just additional fluids for getting hydrated. Oh, this is new. I picked up some CBD oil at a pop-up that we did yesterday and I've tested it out. I tested it out last night. I I can't give it a proper review. I feel like I need to like use it more regularly to be able to give it a proper review. So basically if you don't know what CBD oil is, CBD oil is like basically they take like they extract from the hemp plant None of the properties that get you high, like it doesn't get you high at all. Like, trust me, I'm like kind of sensitive and I did not 
feel high at all. Um, not like I've ever been high and I'm not even lying. I've never done drugs except for like medicine that was necessary for sickness. <laughs> um, anyway, um, it's, it's like they extract the, the part of the hemp plant that just makes you relax and like reduces anxiety and it's supposed to like uh, reduce stress, reduce pain, reduce anxiety, help you relax, help you wind down. This is from Tonic Vibes. Their hashtag is hashtag fix your vibe. And um, basically you take like a dropper and you put it under your tongue before bed. You, there's one like for the day, but this is for the night because I sleep like trash fun fact. Like I definitely don't have like insomnia or anything, but I'm a very restless sleeper and it just takes me so long to just unwind at the end of the day. Like I'll be tired all day long, like yawning, feeling like I could take a nap at any minute. And then when it's bedtime, I, my mind is just wired. I don't know what that is, um, but I have that. And I have a lot of dreams when I sleep. I, and I've heard that when you're dreaming a lot, it means you're not in your deepest form of sleep. So you're actually not sleeping great if you're remembering your dreams. So that was fascinating to me when I learned that. And so figuring out ways to better my sleep is has become like a an important priority for me. So I'm trying out CBD oils. Hello everybody and welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. I say this every single day, but I can't believe how flippin' fast Vlogmas is going by. It's pretty wild, but also pretty exciting. Anyway, um, I'm about to head out to brunch with this girl, Erin, who I met through Instagram, and I've never met her in person, but she's a blogger also, and we're gonna have brunch, and we're going to take pictures because I'm in desperate need of content. Um, my Instagram has been a little weak, and uh, I'm trying to improve on that. Anyway, I decided to kick off this vlog with an OTD because the last couple vlogs of Vlogmas last week, I don't think I did an OTD, but my outfits weren't that great anyway, so it's fine. Uh, and I'm wearing the same thing that I wore yesterday, so we're making up for it. Uh, let's do an OTD and then I'm gonna head out the door. Um, I'm going to brunch at this place, Bouvette, in Greenwich Village, and then I'm going to take pictures with Aaron, and then I actually have to work. So this is a working weekend. I'm working um, Harvest's pop-up shop at Canal Street Market today and tomorrow. So... That's what's going on with me today. As per usual, this mirror is still dirty. I'm very sorry, we'll get to it, I promise. And also my room behind me is a little messy too, so just ignore that. This is my outfit today. I absolutely love this look. Um, so my turtleneck sweater is from Athleta. It was a gift from my mom. I feel like I say it like that every single time, but you know, consistency. And these pants are from Bohm, and I absolutely love them. I got them during Thanksgiving break on Black Friday. I'm obsessed with them. I love these buttons. Super high-waisted, all the good things. And then I'm wearing these, I think they're BP boots. Um, they're little like combat boot type deals. And then I'm wearing my little gold hoops that or a hand-me-down from Maline, but I'm pretty sure they were from a local uh, Montana boutique. And then I'm wearing my Majuri, is that how you pronounce it? Majuri necklace. So that's the look today, people. Let's go eat. <laughs> Yeah, we were 
not about to wait two hours. I am so hungry. So look at this. We are in awe. We both got French toast and cappuccinos and it's just phenomenal. So we're about to dig in. Yay! Hey guys, so a little update. We're currently shooting in Greenwich Village and it's beautiful and so festive. There's like a little, there's people in the background right now, but there's like garlands everywhere and so many Christmas wreaths up on people's doors and it's just so jolly and I love it. Hey guys, so I just wrapped up brunch and photos with Erin and oh my gosh, she's such a cool person. I love her already. It was so nice getting to meet her in person. It's always so exciting when you like really click with people that you meet online because a lot of times it's not like that and people are very different in person than they are on their social media presence. But we had a great time, took some great pictures. I just crossed the street to take a photo of these cute wreaths. And I'm headed to Canal Street Market now to go do my shift. So, yeah. For being like a, like a, how long did I work? I worked from 3.30 to 8. Went by pretty fast. Like, luckily could get some editing done. Caught, caught up on some email situations. And yeah, went by pretty fast. Um, anyway, I am currently headed to Sweet Green Since it's 8 o'clock and I don't really have anything like ready to cook at my apartment and I kind of want something healthy because I had I've only had French toast and coffee today I was like I'm gonna get sweet green because there's one only seven minutes away from Canal Street Market so I'm headed there I'm gonna try a new salad since I don't want to get tired of um, my fave the harvest bowl so I'm trying the guacamole greens this time and I'll show you excited Hi friends, so currently in bed, as you can tell, I had my sweet green, I talked to Aline on the phone, I talked to my mom on the phone, and um, now I'm editing a thumbnail, I'm going to get Vlogmas days 7 through 9 up, and I'm also watching Colleen Ballinger's birth vlog, and now her recovering vlog, and Okay, I also look so terrible. I look like I have a hunchback and I look... There are no words. Anyway, I, I'm so happy for her. Fun fact, Alina and I used to be like... We still are, but you know, like back in the day when we were just like YouTube crazed, Colleen was like one of our OG faves. We even went to one of her Miranda shows and we were obsessed with her. So it's just really cool growing up with these YouTubers and feeling like you've just been a part of their lives for so long and get to be like included on all these crazy milestones and oh my god i cried so much her baby is so cute and her man is so cute and she is so cute and they're just such a cute family and it makes me want to have a baby <laughs> like it's giving me hardcore baby fever and i'm like yeah this is not something i want at this point, but it makes me want to have a baby right now.
happy vlogmas day 16 yeah 16 i know i haven't talked to you guys like face to face all day long so i wanted to just come on here and just like yeah catch up talk about the day because i know i just like took clips here and there but today was definitely one of those days that like if i could skip i would because like just nothing was happening i was working again at canal street market and this morning i just had to get a ton of like stuff done i had to like clean get organized because next week i'm going home i had to um go tone my hair because i wanted it retoned obviously you cannot tell how it looks but it's just a little bit a little bit uh brighter after i got my hair done i came home and um i had to re-upload my pat my last vlogmas y'all know what i'm talking about if you follow me on instagram i was so annoyed there was like some sort of issue with like the rendering of the images that i like to insert anyway um i had a really late lunch i had a lunch at like four or five i think it was five so i had a giant burrito so i ended up just uh, not making dinner and instead i made banana bread obviously this looks awful because it was so hot when i cut it that it just was mush but i wanted to eat it so badly and i wanted to eat it while it's still warm anyway i've just been editing a ton this today like i've been editing a ton catching up on vlogmas i feel very accomplished um yeah i'm getting a little bit tired not gonna lie when like i literally don't ever give myself a break to do anything like this weekend was just like go 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 and then yeah i did some fun stuff like brunch with aaron was super fun but like as an introvert i need time in bed to just relax luckily it's not too late right now it's um gonna be 10 so i think i'll have like i don't know i kind of just want to keep editing but maybe i shouldn't maybe i shouldn't yeah i think i've edited enough for today i'm just gonna watch some other people's vlogmas videos and i'm gonna eat my banana bread and I'm gonna chill. I'll probably read Harry Potter. And yeah, that's the day. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for all your support. This Vlogmas, I can't believe I'm headed home next weekend. It's crazy. And then it's gonna be Christmas. Like, what? Anyway, love you guys so, so much. Good night.